We're going to be talking today about hazardous waste regulation. One of the most important parts of any management program is known as the waste determination. A hazardous waste determination is considered the cornerstone of hazardous waste management because every other regulation is built upon whether you have a hazardous waste or not. Unless you know whether you have a hazardous waste and why it's hazardous, you don't know what regulations apply to you. So we're going to be referring to the regulations a few times uh, during this video and I want you to have this link so that you can go and actually either print out your own copy of the regulations or go to the website so that you can see the actual rules in print. We take this waste determination process and we boil it down to five steps or five questions. First, is it a waste? A lot of what you may think are wastes are not what we think are wastes. We're the government, we have our own rules, we have our own definitions for different terms. So first, is it a waste the way the government means it? Second, is it specifically exempted? Some materials are exempted outright from regulation. Third, is it something we call a listed hazardous waste? Four, is it something we call a characteristic hazardous waste? And lastly, is it a, a material known as a hazardous waste mixture? We only regulate wastes with these rules. Don't confuse hazardous waste with hazardous materials. Hazmat is a whole different set of regulations that USDOT has created. They cover materials that are dangerous and they cover regulations for the transport of those materials. We're only interested in things that are wastes. So if you find you have a waste, as we'll discuss shortly, the next step is to determine whether it's hazardous.